Hello everyone, Ebom113 here with another custom creation. These are my redesigned anti-air locust and redesigned uh, vampire. Uh, show you through each one. Take up this one first. So I think I did a video on an anti-air locust already, but I redesigned it since then. Um, gave it a different head. So I took apart the space banshee for parts. And I thought this one looked a little more aesthetically pleasing. Make it more look like an actual locust. Um, redesigned all the legs too, so now they all match. The original one, they were all or like the front two were different than the back two. I was just going on what parts I had available. Um, doesn't have a bulky section anymore. Did the original one did have like a, a just a regular block? Um, I tried to build around it, but just looked off. So um, just. Got some more parts available. Just redesigned it. So it's just a very basic swivel joint. So you can pivot and swivel it. Swivel. Um, didn't really change base features of any. Just redesigned the legs and gave it a different top. You can still uh, rotate 360 degrees. Look up. Not so much down. So might be a good weakness to exploit. You can get close enough, I can't shoot at you. But, yep, it's pretty much my redesigned locust for now. I really enjoyed building it. Looks better from the top, from my opinion. But, uh, tell me what you all think about it. I'll get on to my redesigned vampire. Um, took out the turret, or the needle turret, and make it, um, I guess, less overpowered because, um, I was looking up all this thing can do, and it seemed like it was pretty powerful. I never played Halo Wars, so I can't really judge on in-unit powers and if it was overpowered or not. But um, Gave it some green lights detailing, so it looks like it's charging up a stasis burst. I do know what it does. I just never personally played it myself. Um, gave it some extra wings. Got it just from the top. figure it can create like a stasis charge and discharge it, take out some vehicles. So I didn't over design it too much, just added a few wings. Make it look a little scarier as it's going through the sky. The purples don't exactly match, but I'm not too worried about it. I still think it looks pretty cool. I guess I could paint it if I really bothered me too much. But that's pretty much it. Maybe it's like a 343 era or post covenant human war variant. I go off that a lot, so if it's not stuff from the games, I guess it's more of an excuse. But, uh. But, um, yeah. I guess that's pretty much it. I don't know where I was going with that. But, uh, thank you all for watching and tell me what you all think. I'll see you next time.